What is poppin' people? We are back with yet another Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon Wi-Fi battle. This time we're hitting up the good old UU tier. I wanted to hit up some Breloom, some Darmanitan, you know what I'm saying? Uh, those are basically the only two Pokemon I really wanted to use in this battle. <laughs> uh, now if you look at our teams, alright, they're basically super hyper offensive and that's exactly what I like. In Pokemon battles on Wi-Fi at, at least you know on, at least on Wi-Fi you got to bring the hyper offense makes for an exciting quick battle nobody wants to battle for 10 hours at a time watching a damn Mantine use roost for the entire duration of the battle now am I right or am I wrong I'm pretty sure I'm right anyways didn't play too well in this one but it's okay we're still gonna get right into it check out my opponent's channel in the description as well after the battle if you want to see some more stuff on his channel anyways I'm gonna lead off with the Breloom. Put them up. I've had my Breloom's name as put them up for the last five years. All right, so you're gonna put them up. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Anyways, so put them up comes out. He leads off with Latias. This isn't the best look, but he has no grass types on his team. So I'm just gonna stay in. I have a focus sash. I can stay in, take the hit, hit him with a spore. That's exactly what I do. So uh, if you guys notice, I don't have any Pokemon on my team that can use Stealth Rock. I got this team from the same place I get all my teams. <laughs> Had I known that, I probably would have put some Stealth Rock somewhere on this team. But, I'm going to go out to my Pre-Marina. Um, I wasn't sure if he was going to stay in or not with the Latias. Um, so I decided to bring out Pre-Marina just in case he wanted to stay in. Because I didn't really have anything to hit him with. Um, but he goes out to his Nido King. Now, I probably should have stayed in for the Rock Tomb. Uh, but I didn't, so that sucks. Uh, so I'm going to have to switch out to my Poon Gobbler. <laughs> And uh, I take the Sludge Wave pretty nicely. I know he's going to go out to his Pre-Marina. Um, so I'm going to go for the Thunderbolt on the Switch. And I switch this thing's EVs from Max Special Attack to Max Speed. Um, so it doesn't do too much, but it doesn't do too little either. And then especially since I'm going to go for another Thunderbolt and get a crit. Because this game is great, isn't it? Isn't this game just a wonderful testament to the player's skill? It's a, it's a contest of who has the better trained Pokemon. No, I'm kidding, game's trash. Anyways, I get the crit. So, so far, he missed Draco Meteor turn one, and then I got a crit, um, so that's fine. Uh, I had no Pokemon at all to take any kind of flying type move, so I basically have to pick which Pokemon's gonna die here. Um, Latias probably wasn't the play here, honestly, if I'm being real. I probably should've switched in maybe Crawdon, maybe even Breloom, but, uh, Bygones are gonna be bygones. We're gonna let them be bygones and let them stay bygones because my Latias, I have to wait by. It's gone. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. That's a knee slapper if I, man, you know what? Never mind. Anyways, I go out to my pre marine after he obliterates my Latias. He misses Hurricane. <laughs> and then I'm gonna finish him off with a Moonblast. So he's missed Draco Meteor, Hurricane. And got crit by Thunderbolt. But see, the thing about that is, if you don't want those things to happen, Dragon Pulse is right there. Aerial Ace is right there. <laughs> Anyways, so he goes for Stealth Rocks on the Switch. He knew I wasn't going to stay in that time. Um, good play on his part. He's going to go for the Sludge Wave. It's going to bring me down to my Sash. Now, here I'm going to get another crit. All right? Just letting y'all know, right now, I get another critical hit. But I guess it kind of... It kind of adds up because I only got two hits of the Bullet Seed. So had I got more and killed his Nidoking, I would have been pretty unfortunate. Especially since if I got one more, I would have been able to kill him with a Mach Punch. So it's kind of unfortunate for me. You know what I'm saying? I'm playing the victim this time. I kind of lose in this situation. Um, but here I'm going to bring out my Nodont. Go for the Aqua Jet, trying to kill this thing. But he's uh, going to go for the Switch, actually, which was a good play on his part. I didn't really have any other choice, kind of. I probably did. I probably could have gone up to like Darmanitan and maybe gone for the uh, for the Flare Blitz. Um, but whatever. I probably should have gone for another Aqua Jet here, but I wasn't sure how fast that thing would be. Usually Beware has max HP, not max uh, speed. And I'm pretty sure this one has max speed because uh, it outsped my Crawdon. Here he makes a good play. This was basically a 50-50. Kind of? Oh, you know what? I just realized. I made a dumb play there. I thought his pre-marina was still alive, but it wasn't. Holy crap. That's why I did that stupid ass play. I was wondering why I didn't just go straight for the uh, Flare Blitz there. 
That's what I was saying in the beginning when I said I didn't play too well. I went for fucking U-turn. I knew he wasn't going to bring in his Latias. Not while it's asleep, anyways. Wow. <laughs> I went for U-turn thinking he was going to bring his dead Primarina into the battle. Oh, my God. Hindsight is a bitch. Man, that man, this, this battle never happened, man. This battle never happened. This is not me battling. I gave um, my 3DS to my dog to play, uh, and he... Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> yeah, so my dog was playing, you know what I'm saying? And then he had his homeboy Chihuahua over here uh, telling him how to play, but Chihuahua doesn't even play Pokemon. So when he told him to go for the U-turn, it was just because he likes the color green, not because he thought U-turn was the best play to make, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, I'm serious, though. Um, yeah, I guess I just messed up there because I'm watching the battle, and I, you know, I usually make a lot of realizations when I commentate over the battle. <laughs> and I really just realized that the Primarina died, and I went for U-turn thinking it was coming out. That was stupid. Holy crap. Anyways. <sighs> the battle's over. I lost. <laughs> Good game, uh, Sharpedo. I'm going to leave your link in the description. We'll be back tomorrow with a better battle. I promise you. I promise you, okay? Also, later today, I am going to be streaming the Nintendo Direct on my Twitch channel. Uh, it starts at 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time and 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So pull up twitch.tv slash shofu. We're going to have a grand old time with some nice com. I need to go get some headphones, actually, from the store. Because I don't have any with me right now. I'm still, uh, you know... My, my stuff hasn't even got to my house yet. I'm using a microphone with no with no headphones and my laptop right now. <laughs> Luckily, I do have internet so I can Wi-Fi battle and stuff. Um, but yeah, go ahead and pull up to my Twitch uh, around 2 p.m. Uh, Pacific Standard Time, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And we're going to have a grand old time reacting to these uh, announcements Nintendo trying to make. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Love you all. Hit that like button, comment, subscribe. I'm out of here. Bye. <laughs>